I bet you didn't know Earth's biomes are this diverse. Let's dive in, shall we? From the steamy tropics to icy polar realms, each biome is unique. Discover the flora, fauna, rainfall and temperatures of our planet's diverse habitats. Ready for the adventure? There are nine distinct biomes on our planet, each with unique characteristics and ecosystems. I don't think people understand just how magical tropical rainforests really are. Let's explore why. Picture this. Towering trees stretching up to 200 feet forming a lush green canopy that blocks out the sun. Beneath this emerald roof, a dark and humid world thrives, filled with fallen leaves, twisting vines and shimmering streams. Consistently warm temperatures between 20 degrees Celsius and 30 degrees Celsius cradle the forest in a perpetual summer. Rain? Oh, it pours between 200 and 450 centimetres annually, drenching the forest in life-sustaining moisture. From the emergent layers sky-high giants to the forest floor's damp, decomposing blanket, vegetation is dense and diverse. Evergreen trees, orchids and bromeliads paint a vibrant picture. And the wildlife? Astonishing. Monkeys swing, parrots chatter and jaguars prowl. Poisonous frogs, colourful butterflies and countless insects buzz in this bustling paradise. Discover the tropical rainforest, a world teeming with life, wonder and secrets waiting to be unveiled. Picture endless fields of green and gold. This is the grassland biome. Grasslands are vast, open landscapes dominated by grasses with few trees. Think rolling hills, flat plains and the occasional shrub, usually near water. It's a place of wide skies and far horizons. Depending on the season, the grasses can be green or golden, creating a sea of color. Temperatures here swing from icy winters of minus 20 degrees Celsius to scorching summers of 30 degrees Celsius. Rainfall is moderate, just enough to keep deserts at bay, but not enough for forests. The plant life is tough, designed to survive drought, fire, and grazing. Grasses like buffalo grass and rye grass dominate with occasional acacia trees and savannas. Wildlife in grasslands is diverse and fascinating. You'll find herds of bison, antelope, and zebras grazing peacefully. Predators like lions in the savannas and wolves in temperate grasslands are always on the hunt. Raptors soar above while insects like grasshoppers buzz below. Grasslands are shaped by natural disturbances like fire and grazing, which maintain this incredible landscape. It's a world of wonder waiting to be discovered. What's something people don't know about deserts? They are teeming with life, surprisingly adapted to extreme conditions. Deserts are stark, barren landscapes, often stretching far and wide with sand, gravel or bare rock. By day, the sun blazes, sending temperatures soaring over 40 degrees Celsius. By night, the cold creeps in, sometimes nearing freezing. Rain is a rare visitor here, with less than 25 centimeters of precipitation annually. When it does rain, it's brief and intense, a fleeting miracle. But life finds a way. Desert plants like cacti and succulents are masters of survival, storing precious water in thick, waxy leaves. Their deep roots tap into underground reserves, standing resilient against the drought. And then there's the wildlife. From the nocturnal kangaroo rat to the elusive sidewinder rattlesnake, every creature is a testament to nature's ingenuity. Even birds like roadrunners and owls have adapted to this unforgiving land. In the desert, extremes are the norm, yet life thrives in remarkable ways. Truly, it's nature's toughest terrain. I bet you didn't know the Mediterranean chaparral is both lush and fire-prone. Let's take a closer look. Picture this. Rugged hills, dense shrubs and small trees creating a landscape that's both breathtaking and resilient. In spring, wildflowers burst with color, but come summer it's all about muted greens and browns. The weather? Think mild. Wet winters with temperatures between 10 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius, that's 50 degrees Fahrenheit to 68 degrees Fahrenheit, and hot, dry summers often hitting over 30 degrees Celsius, 86 degrees Fahrenheit, sometimes even 40 degrees Celsius, 104 degrees Fahrenheit. Rain mostly falls in winter, about 25 to 75 centimeters, 10 to 30 inches yearly, making summer nearly rain-free. Chaparral plants are survival experts, drought-resistant with small, hard leaves to save water. 
Ever seen manzanita, chamise or scrub oak? They thrive here along with aromatic sages and yuccas. And the wildlife? Coyotes, bobcats, mule deer and even jackrabbits roam these parts. Birds like quail and hawks and reptiles like lizards and snakes add to the diversity. So next time you're exploring the Mediterranean, remember, the chaparral is a true testament to nature's resilience. We're exploring one of Earth's most dynamic ecosystems, the temperate grasslands of North America. Picture this, vast rolling hills and flat plains stretching as far as the eye can see. These grasslands are a sea of green in spring, turning golden brown by late summer. The plant life here is mostly grasses, like buffalo grass and wheat grass. This biome is teeming with life, bison, pronghorn, coyotes, and even majestic eagles. The temperate grasslands receive an average annual precipitation of 20 to 35 inches, with temperatures ranging from 40 degrees in winter to 100 degrees in summer. So next time you see a sweeping plain, you'll know. It's more than just grass. If you're a nature lover, you need to explore North America's temperate, deciduous forest. It's a living, breathing canvas of seasonal change. Spring and summer drape the forest in vibrant greens, thanks to a dense canopy of broadleaf trees. Come autumn, the leaves burst into brilliant reds, oranges, and yellows. Winter strips the trees bare, leaving a serene, snow-covered landscape. The forest thrives on moderate temperatures, ranging from a balmy 30 degrees hikes in summer to a chilly 20 degrees hikes in winter. It receives 30 to 60 inches of precipitation annually, split between rain and snow, creating a lush environment. Dominated by oak, maple, and birch trees, the forest floor is a playground for ferns, wildflowers, and shrubs like azaleas. Wildlife, think deer, black bears, and songbirds like robins and blue jays. This biome's seasonal rhythm supports a diverse tapestry of life, making it one of the most stunning ecosystems on Earth. None can prepare you for the raw beauty of the tundra. Ready to explore? Picture an endless open landscape where the ground is locked in ice. That's the North American tundra for you, an area defined by permafrost, tiny ponds, and resilient vegetation. Winter here is brutal, with temperatures plummeting to minus 40 degrees. But when summer graces the tundra, the icy facade cracks open to reveal bursts of wildflowers and patches of green. Despite receiving only 6 to 10 inches of precipitation annually, the tundra remains wet in summer due to melting snow. The sparse vegetation, mosses, lichens, and dwarf shrubs, hugs the ground to brave the strong winds and nutrient-poor soil. Wildlife here? Tough as nails. Think caribou, arctic foxes, and migratory birds like the arctic tern. Even insects thrive, with mosquitoes and midges buzzing about during the short summer, feeding the hungry birds. The North American tundra is a testament to nature's resilience, a harsh yet beautiful biome where life finds a way. Intrigued? Stay tuned for more wild adventures. If your idea of a winter wonderland includes polar bears and penguins, you're in for a chilly treat. 
let's explore the polar ice biome. These icy realms, the Arctic and Antarctic, are blanketed in endless expanses of ice and snow. The Arctic boasts drifting ice flows and vast ice-covered seas, while Antarctica's rugged mountain ranges and towering ice shelves are truly awe-inspiring. Temperatures here, brutally cold. Arctic winters can drop to minus 50 degrees Celsius, while Antarctica goes even colder, plunging below minus 60 degrees Celsius. And don't expect much precipitation, these regions are some of the driest on Earth, with snowfall accumulating slowly over millennia. Despite this harsh climate, life finds a way. Arctic landscapes are dotted with hardy mosses, lichens and even some flowering plants. In the Antarctic, life clings on with resilient mosses and lichens. Wildlife in these regions is just as remarkable. In the Arctic, you'll find polar bears, Arctic foxes and caribou, while Antarctica is home to iconic penguins and seals. These creatures have evolved incredible adaptations to thrive in these frozen frontiers. The polar ice biome stark, desolate, yet profoundly beautiful. A testament to nature's resilience and wonder.